Hello again, friends. I'm C. Darrow, and welcome back to Chained Echoes. We are currently in Perpetua, the flower fields of Perpetua, and about to find out what exactly this hero of Lanar statue is going to be giving us. And whether or not we are actually strong enough to defeat the trial. I greet ye, adventures of Valandis. My voice, echoing through thy heart, shall bestow upon thee the power of ages long gone by. Prove thyself worthy and thou shalt receive the gift. What are we- Holy shit! Oh, okay. What oh, is this ultra? Deals high non-elemental damage to one enemy. And that seems like a trap. Um, I feel like the owls are probably probably target number one, honestly. Glenn is going to ultra. Beautiful. Everyone's broken a little bit. And I kind of want to do the defensive buff, but at the same time, we really do need... We do need to heal. We really need to heal. Yeah. We cannot let uh, Bothraz... Is that his name? Bothraz? We can't let him go down. Absolutely not. Free water jump? Who do we switch with? Oh. Yeah, we're gonna swap up. We'll take our blade reflection. Maybe we'll get lucky and not have to not eat any damage this turn. Just a just a smidge. Oh, they're already they're already attack broken. That's funny. I still want to drop his below overdrive, but I guess we I guess we kind of have to. I think we are going to wide swing here. We're gonna hold off on the heal. Okay, maybe that was a bad idea. Oh, please don't everyone attack her. I only have one weapon summoned right now. She took 50 poison damage. Holy hell. Now, do we pick her up? Yeah, I think we do. Most of most of the attacks on that side are all single target. Yeah, this is a great idea. Summon, 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 summon. First try. I really thought we would have to give that a couple shots. I thought we would have to, uh, maybe switch out some passives or something. You've mastered the challenge, brave warriors, and prove yourself worthy. 
Accept the emblem offered by Reina, Rania the Shaman. Go forth, brave warriors and curious adventurers, for thee are the future of Eldria. Hell yes. Last emblem, six king owls. When an encounter, in, an encounter against a scorpion with only eight actions. I don't think we're ready for that yet. We'll get there, but not, not yet. That's okay, we don't really need to get there until we go back and fight alpha wolves. Until we make that connection, nothing else really matters. Oh, 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 but... Shaman. What does Shaman do? Raise magic by 10%. Raise TP gain through normal attacks by 5. I don't think that part really matters. Magical attack dealing 1.5x water damage to 1. Magical earth attack dealing damage to 1. Okay, that doesn't... <laughs> it, doesn't it doesn't really matter. Um, the earth damage is not bad, but... I am too lazy to switch him off a of vampire right now. So I think we're going to put this on lean for the time being. It gives her eight... Eight bonus magic. Which is huge. Um, real quick. Skill set. I'm lean. Okay, those are... Do we care about learning Aqua while she has Water Thrust? Not really, right? Yeah, I think we're just going to go ahead and... No, we'll keep it on. No, that's a dumb idea. That's a dumb idea. Who let me do that? Trade that up for Wind Thrust. Alright, now where are we going? Not here. This was a one-way trip. So long. Thanks for all the fish. I see something? Oh yeah, there's a, there's a little steam geyser back there. Now, next question, how do we get out of here? Where did we, where did we even come in at? At least the music's good while I while I struggle bust through here. Oh, right there! Found it. Once again, I cannot see that at all. I feel like I'm not gonna find any of the secret caves here either. It's just gonna be a struggle all day. I wonder if this was here before we did the um, the mushroom thing up north at the beginning of yesterday, or at the end of yesterday. Now, where are we? Yeah, I think we're going we're going north. We're gonna knock down that barrier quick. That is not the way. Let's drop some of the fluid on this fungus. 
Yes, let's. Oh, we found two meals. It's even better than snacks. is where we came from before, correct? Yep. Am I just overlooking the barrier? I thought it was to the east here, wasn't it? Like, due east? Oh, come on, let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Uh, maybe that has an effect to the south of us. Maybe we can get to the mega chest now. What I would give for a mini map in this game. Secret cave. I was wrong. I did find one, but only one. Let's not. Let's not get carried away. Ooh, that's a lot of money. Okay, but how do we go north from here? Is there a way to get on that? I'm not seeing it. One thing I'm really liking about this game is the reward board. Um, as gamers, a lot of us really love... We're, we're just kind of completionists, right? You just want to do everything. You want to you wanna find all the treasure chests, even if you don't need them. You want to find all the secret caves, even if it doesn't matter. But... Where the hell is that barrier? <laughs> is it south? Oh my god, it's totally south. I've been going almost right to it. Um, but a lot of us are just naturally completionists. And in gaming, there's been a very big push towards the barrier's gone. There's been a push towards like achievements and whatnot, which which is great. It's great. But ultimately like achievements don't matter. Nobody really cares about achievements. But the reward board is essentially achievements. Right? Like it's doing all the exact same things complete these completely random quests. Uh, find all the treasure on the map. Open up all the caves. Defeat all the unique monsters. Like, it's achievement hunting, except you're getting sick rewards for it.
Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Nani? Oh, okay. I've just visited everywhere except where we're supposed to go. But, um, the way that they did the reward board in this game is just... It's just great. Really, really appreciate it. I feel like after we've gone through and poured water on all these different little mushrooms, uh, we're gonna have to go through and do a full recheck of the entire area. Oh, I don't want to fight three of them. Jesus, put him down to 7 HP. Turn one. Now, as long as they don't poison us, because that poison does so much damage. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna switch out. He doesn't have any health, anyways. And over here, we have Light Spin. Guys, show me how blind you are. No, don't poison me. Oh, the worst. Don't re poison me. Probably good to just punch away here, right? Oh, shit. I didn't realize how low his health was. That's not great. Oh, they're gonna kill both rods. No! Actually, yeah, let's heal him up. We should be able to survive the poison. We're overheated, that sucks. Summon attack should get a kill. Or it'll just try hard. Do we have any good AoE? Because <laughs> cause we're out. Just get a kill. There's eight scorpions. There's our ten collectibles. Defeat the capo. Oh, there's another thing to throw water on up there. How do we get there? I think we don't. There's another one here, though. And that area's entire purpose was to put water on the mushroom. We can fight. Do we need to fight? Defeat all unique monsters. I forgot about that one. Do 
we do need to we need to fight Sporman. Oh, I just got it, a Sporman instead of a Snowman. Okay. Okay, that's cute. Try your blade reflection. I don't know how much it's actually gonna do here, but better than not having it. King Owls are strong against light. I don't know if light claymore is the way to go. I think we're just gonna try to kill the owl quick. take us out if we use wide swing, so I'm not, not feeling it. Let's... She's blind and oiled. Uh, let's heal up Balthras and we can just switch Sienna out. Water jump, is that okay? Maybe we should be focusing on the owl, but. Oh, but he's almost dead. Glenn, a no. She might just die to the owl now. Yep, <laughs> just like that. Uh, we have summon attack though. That poison is miserable. I don't know what that's even supposed to be. At least with like a jar of cleansed mucus, I know what it means. I don't like it, but I know what it means. Yak grass fiber? Is that really the end of our little journey here? Can we not go anywhere else? No way. No way, man. We need that. Oh, we can go all the way around now. Okay. Okay, game. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Uh, 
All right, where where'd they come from this time? Is it this one? Nope. I already did that. Is it over here? Nope. Oh, was it to the south? It was not. There's nothing else to the south. He's stuck in a silver sword. Oh, jeez. It's the same attack. Okay, well, obviously it's not good to switch it right now. Probably the same thing here. Well, I guess I could have... Nah, we'll just... We'll just let it sit. We'll let it sit. It's kind of painful, though. Alright, well that was fun. How do we go north? Are we able to go north through here? Ooh, it's kind of looking like it. Hell yeah! I'm selling stuff in such dangerous places, I usually raise the prices. Because it's you, I'll make an exception. Well, buddy. We're selling stuff. I hope you've got big pockets. Nice. I'll take it. A trove of gold. What do you got for me? What do you got for me? Five gold ore? Hell yeah, we're gonna sell that. And that's all we're gonna sell, because we don't have anything else here. Old puppets. Light and grit or light and heavy armor? Sword and great sword for? Another carrot hose. Carrot nose old puppet. What would the old puppet be? And then wine bottles. I don't know where we might even find a wine bottle. We're definitely leveling up the East stock. Definitely. Do we care about the silver sword, though? Oh no, that takes all of our silver away. We'd only be able to level it once. This area is, like, ominously cleared out. I was so sure something was coming for us. Glenn? I'm not feeling too well. It's the seagull's fault. I saw uh, it's that beast again. There it is. She looks like an angel. Trap most sweet. Be gone, demon. You have no place in the world of men. Oh, God. <laughs> Whoa. What was right, Kylian? <laughs> Guess it's showing its true form, huh? This monster seems to feed on travelers by lulling their senses first. No lullabies for us today, my dear. Everyone, get ready. It doesn't look like it wants to leave this time. Ooh, all right. I was not expecting this. Um, I think we lead with an arms break. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
take it all back for leading with an ultra move. They are both strong to dark and weak to light. Luckily, I have Light Claymore and Light Sword. Oh, I really don't know which one to hit first, though. Let's uh, let's go after let's go after the puppeteer. that blinding light but it did not blind anybody and it didn't do very much damage I'm uh I'm, I'm hesitant here I think we're going to bleed and poison both of them. and uh, nobody's going to be able to physical attack for a bit, so we're just going to use... Actually, it's switching next turn. Alright, this is fine. We can Yoko Gear. What's going on? I feel so dizzy all of a sudden, but why? Whoa, God! <laughs> what is going on? Look at that overheat bar. You feel dizzy because we are dizzy. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do exactly. Uh, we are going to use our TP regen. Our TP is already running low. Thing we do. Okay, if we decoy, that keeps us in overdrive. I don't. I don't think I like doing. If we could not do that, that'd be great. him on most of us. Oh, everyone already had that? Cool.
I think it's summoned a tech ton. Everything's kind of lined up. I think we're in a good spot for it. Oh, he got a kill! Kind of, kind of an accident. I really wanted to steal, but... But that's, that's okay. It's okay. Um, there is... There is a way for us to drop back down into overdrive. Shaman's robe. Man, now I want to know what we got from the other guy. From the puppeteer. We're gonna oil. I wanna hit her with fire. Back it down. This place is crazy. Come, let's go. Let's go on. Don't want to see another demon appear. Everything's because of the Grand Grimoire. I mean, we're we are making an assumption there. Maybe the Grand Grimoire is like, maybe it's good. We don't know. We don't know. We only really need three of these right now. So grabbing something from the right side might just be better. 25 health, that's huge. Yeah, we'll grab that for Glenn. Lean's in the same boat. She doesn't need any passive skills. Uh, she might benefit from the magic plus two. Well, she would. But would she benefit more from magic or health points? We'll take we'll take magic. What is skill set skill? Okay, Victor could use another passive. And Rob and Sienna can use another passive. Nobody else, though. So Victor needs one. Ether Killer could be kind of cool. No, we're taking we're taking defense up. Ten percent defense up, and I think that goes up to twenty percent at level three. Is so huge. And Rob needs one. Rob can have. Uh, Rob can have. Uh, I don't know. Poison. Water resistance. And Sienna. Oh, she needs more rare drops for sure.
sword wave. Oh, this damn thing. Oh, I want it so bad. Wait, 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 wait. What the hell happens with Kylian? Four and eleven? Five and twelve. What happens with Kindly? Why are these all question marks? I don't like that. Kylian's our homeboy, man. We can't... Can't lose him. Agility, attack points, attack. We just want the attack? He has been a heavy AoE attacker for us lately, so we're gonna go with that. Oh my god. That Berserker would be kind of cool too. Knowing how much damage he deals now. Like getting him up to two or three summoned weapons and then Berserker summoned attack. It is a lot of setup, but that is a ton of damage. I might just give him defense or agility. Let's give him defense. And save so long as we're here. Check around this way quick. I'm not sure we went over here. What the hell? Spearmaster, crit damage up. Oh, you guys almost let me walk right by that. How do we get to that? Oh, I want it. I want it. I need to know why it looks so different. Could that be something we have to get to with our uh, with our sky armor? And it's gigantic because we can't open it unless we have sky armor. <laughs> Oh, we got we got things here. Looks like they point to maybe the top of that bubble. Oh, wrong bubble. No, that was the right one. Where is it? Here? Hey, hey, hey. Right, I think we're going north. I am so concerned with Kylie's skills. He's our bud, man. He's talking about, um... He's talking about how he wants the, the Grand Grimoire for himself. For good, of course. And now his skills aren't even showing up? That's shady as shit. This place seems safe. Let's take a rest before continuing. Oh, I can feel it. I feel it slowly pulling up my body. I do not know how much longer I can travel with you. Kingdom for a cure to this rising sobriety. Does he always act like this? He's supposed to be one of our leading scientists? He is quite headstrong, but truth to be told, I also long for a glass of Arcadian wine. 
Please tell, Sir Victor. You trust us enough to reveal the secrets behind the grimoire, yet not enough to reveal why you do that. Oh, believe me, I trust you enough to share every secret I carry. It's just that I can't tell you. I made a promise. Sir Victor is not the only one with secrets, is he? What do you mean? You survived the Warrenshire disaster, did you not? But how? You were there? Yes. Sir Cameron mentioned that only the user in the immediate vicinity is spared. Tell them. You know about this lean? Fine, I'll tell you about it. I was the one that did it. And therefore, I have even more the reason to destroy this weapon. You... you... you lousy piece of shit. Calm down, Rob. Calm down? He's a mass murderer. He's killed hundreds of Taran soldiers. No, I'm sorry. Save your words. Rob, leave him be. But Princess, surely you don't mean to forgive him. There's nothing to forgive because he's not the one to blame. The Grand Grimmar was there for a reason. It was there because... because of my lord brother. Psst. Princess may forgive you, but I do not. Mantle yourself in your convenient lies for all I care. Rob has angst. Why did we take him with us? Is it still far to the monastery? A bit. It is located on an island just off the coast. Due to the regular earthquakes on Valandus, strong whirlpools have formed around the island and blocked any access above water. And then we should have taken an airship. Unfortunately, this territory is free of air stones. The only way to reach the monastery is through an old escape tunnel. It takes us under the seabed over the island. Under the seabed? Sounds almost scarier than this place here. Well, let's move on then. Eager to find out more about the Grimoire, are you? Alright, the uh, mystery is waiting to be lifted. General Godfrey, you are the first to enjoy this new power. What does it feel like? Your Highness, I feel as if I was in a dream. My head is slightly befogged, but boiling blood is running through my body. Every move, every breath, I perceive it consciously. I'm glad to hear that. Think of it as a gift that you should use in Terran's favor. Your Highness. A messenger brought us news from beyond the Emerald Sea. Prince Treklar has taken the capital. His last brother has been executed. The war is over and Nebrelia has a new king. So it's only a matter of time until they turn their gaze towards Valandis. And it will happen sooner rather than later. That makes it all the more important to end our war quickly. Only a united Valandis stands a chance against the enemies beyond. Sir Gwain. My prince, take General Godfrey with you and instruct him. As you command, follow me, General. Listen to me carefully. Fleets of Tarin and Escania will collide in the sky above Roland Fields. Only airships may outnumber our airships may outnumber them. But we still want to keep our casualties as low as possible. Especially considering that a fight with Nebrellium might follow. You can count on me, Sir Gwain. What is going on here? That is an awful lot of security. Your newly acquired power will cut a path through enemy lines and pave the way for our main weapon. The Grand Grimoire? Exactly. Listen well, General. When the Grimoire is shattered, it gives off a tremendous explosion that devours all life in a radius of a thousand meters. Of thousands of meters. Such a weapon must not be used in our own lines. After opening the way through the enemy's vanguard with your new powers, you will board the Sky Armor and bring the Grimoire behind enemy lines. 
There, you will smash it. Uh, I am supposed to carry the Grand Grimoire? Isn't there anyone else that could do this? I was told you are one of Tarin's better pilots. That's true, but... Oh, I see. You're worried the explosion would kill you too. No, calm your fears. A weapon that kills its user is pointless. Grimoire spares everything within a radius of three meters. Nothing will happen to you, General, nor to your sky armor. I... Is that so? <laughs> of course, I am not afraid of death. But can't we just hurl the stone into the enemy's airships? And fear to miss the target? The stone would land somewhere on Earth and destroy an entire region. And to throw the stone at such a distance, we would need a cannon. If the stone was to break in its own cannon's barrel, it would be our army that would be destroyed and not the enemy's. I understand. Leave it to me, then. An easy task for a man of my caliber. I expected nothing less. Look at it. Isn't it beautiful? These colors. It looks so... magnificent. Yeah. Magnificent glow for a tool so foul. I hate it. Whew. Give me the dry strike and toxic extender. Thank you. Exactly what I wanted for Christmas. Oh, is this a way out? That's the way out. Guys, that's the way out. Meaning we are done for today. Thank you so very much for joining me. Really appreciate it. I hope to see you again tomorrow. Have a fantastic day. Take care.